Thanks. Now back to another breaking story. A Woodbury police officer in the hospital this hour after being stabbed on duty. Police just gave an update. News 8's Bob Wilson is live there with that. Bob, what do we know? Yeah, state police say it was pretty much a straight up attack after a traffic stop. It happened here on North Main Street. You can still see state police behind us here. They are the major crimes. They have a vehicle uh, surrounded with tape. It was a traffic stop that happened around 1:24 this afternoon. That's when Officer Tim Wright got out of his cruiser and kind of went forward towards the vehicle he had stopped. The state police say the man jumped, the driver jumped out of his seat and came straight at the trooper, stabbed him in the neck. Trooper, uh, sorry, Officer Tim Wright, he is working under the state police. He was able to trigger his radio, call for help, and get other officers here. They were able to tase the suspect. We don't know his name or anything about him, get him on the ground and in handcuffs. Uh, Officer Tim Wright was taken to the hospital. A sergeant kind of took him in his police cruiser because they weren't sure when exactly the ambulance was going to arrive. A lot of work going on here, a lot of pieces to all put together here as they try to figure out exactly what happened. But right now, they say it seemed like it was a routine traffic stop, but that's not the case. Every traffic stop can be a problem. No, no call is routine whatsoever. So it, it does not matter even if it's uh, a minor traffic violation that we observe. We still have a, a heightened sense of awareness when we're approaching that as well as a sense of caution in how we deal with it because we don't know. We don't know going into these circumstances what is going to happen and what this person's intentions are. And this situation unfolded very, very quickly. Very quickly. He was just walking up to him and that's when he got stabbed in the neck. He was taken to Waterbury Hospital in Good condition, stable condition tonight, recovering from his injuries, very traumatic experience. I will tell you, he is a veteran of the Waterbury Police Department for 20 years, and he came here and worked in uh, Woodbury for 10 years, so he, he knows his way around. They say it's believed that he actually knew the suspect of this case. We're expecting more details on the suspect a little bit later on, and we'll bring those details as they become available. I'm Bob Wilson reporting live in Woodbury, News 8.